Stay pretty seasonal as we go through the day. You are good to go if you plan on taking a walk. Any outdoor activities are going to be good to go for today. So enjoy it because this weekend looking a bit more dicey. That patio forecast, if you plan on working from home today, maybe you have the day off, look at what we'll be experiencing. Good amount of sunshine this morning. More clouds into the afternoon, but temperatures will be right around the upper 70s and lower 80s. And then tonight, if you have plans to go out for dinner or if you are going to Friday after 5, anything that's going on tonight, you will likely have dry weather. It's late tonight and into early tomorrow morning, like around midnight, where we will start to see some of those showers. They will likely become more widespread into the early morning hours of your Saturday. Temperatures likely not to fall that much because of the southerly winds, and then you have the cloud and rainfall on top of it. So here we are looking at satellite and radar. We are dry, good to go. We'll just notice more cloud cover and a bit of a breeze this afternoon. Showers are out to our west and also to the south and west. West and we'll be moving in our direction. These heavier, more uh, stronger storms will stay to the south of us. We're primarily just looking at scattered showers, maybe some rumbles of thunder and lightning, but nothing severe. So walking you through your Friday, clouds and mixture of sunshine this afternoon. Here we are overnight and into early Saturday morning. We start to see more of that shower activity. It's likely going to become widespread. Some of these pockets will put down some heavier showers, but you're also going to notice some areas of dry time and mainly light showers. So I don't think it is going to be raining cats and dogs all day long. I do think you're still going to have some, times, uh, some time where you will experience some drier weather. But keep the rain gear with you because we are likely to see another band through the afternoon that could likely impact us. So if you don't really see much in the morning time, you're likely to see some in the afternoon. And then as we get into your evening, that's when the drier skies do start to roll in. We will keep the isolated chances in effect for your Sunday, but I do think some of those... Rain showers will move out of here, and that'll allow for some sunshine and drier weather. So here's a look at your weekend. Tomorrow, temperatures are definitely going to take a hit, but it's still going to feel comfortable. Just know scattered showers, have the rain gear ready to go. Then Sunday rolls in, we will likely see a good amount of sunshine, and temperatures will be hotter because these showers that are coming in will be coming with a warm front. So that's why we're going to see a bit of a warm-up between Saturday and Sunday, just some isolated showers. Some of those will continue into your Monday. And then we start to trend more humid, more summer-like. You can see temperatures start moving up into the mid to upper 80s, and that's likely to bring those daily rain chances.